What's up, folks? Today is Wednesday, January the 10th, I think, or something like that. Uh, we are, we finally come over here to get this equipment. We about got the hydraulic pump put on this morning. Uh, we got it put on yesterday. We got the tank on today, and we finished up everything on it. Well, and once it warmed up a little bit, we wanted to come get this equipment for it. So, because we got to do some stuff to it. <clears throat> um, we got tired of waiting on the truck driver, so we're just going to drive it to the shop. We're about, I don't know, probably six miles from the shop, so it ain't going to be too bad of a drive. But I figured this would be a good time to talk to y'all and get y'all a little video out and check it out. Uh, first off, I want to say thank you to all my new subscribers. I know I've been not the best YouTuber in the world this past two weeks. Uh, I've spent some family time and a little bit of time hunting and trying to get over this cold this past week. I feel better now. Uh, still not quite 100%, but I feel better. I sound like 0%, but... Anyway, we are in trying to figure out which job we're going to go to next. Uh, we aren't 100% sure on which one we're going to go to next. But we're going to try and figure that out and get all our equipment straight. So once we start this year off, we can go on with it. Um, and we pull out and pass state troopers. I mean, I don't know if there's anything illegal. I don't know why I would be. Farmers drive shit up and down the roads all the time. But yeah. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thanks to all my new subscribers. It really does mean a lot. I've enjoyed watching the channel grow. I've enjoyed putting videos out for y'all. Um, I've enjoyed a lot. I'm, all of the people that I've met and all the friends that I've come to know through the channel. Um, <clears throat> this past two weeks, I think, I hadn't, I, I hadn't even really kept up with Blogger Wade and Cotton Top and Alex Desgate and that's 319 and I don't even know if Skipper Cavs put a video out. Um, but I'm trying to catch up on their videos. And get it going. Um, catch back up a little bit. See what everybody's been up to. And all that good stuff. But these boys are running about 17 miles an hour right now. No, about 15. Alright. In all reality, they could really run about 25, but they're trying. You don't want to push this old equipment too much. They'll probably open it up here in just a little while, but I'm um, trying to keep it in pretty good shape so we can at least get it to the shop. Because right now, the load is sitting in the shop, and we have no way of getting it out until we get the skidder back or until a truck comes by. So. We're gonna pull over and let some of these cars go by. <clears throat> Ain't nothing like a logger to piss people off, boy. Logging equipment, just the instantaneous, makes people mad as fire. You reckon we need to get a new brake on that grapple? <laughs> it needs one bad. I need a whole new skitter, but um, and we're in the we're in the midst of Mike Pine one, um, a skitter and a loader. It's always still in pretty decent shape. But uh <clears throat> exactly how this stuff's gonna work out. Anyway, 
I just figured I'd shoot a quick video of this. This is just a normal day in the life of Lager Brand. Um, 95% of the time, if we're not more than about 10, 12 miles from the shop, we'll drive our stuff back and forth, or to the job and back. <laughs> Other than a loader, I mean, of course. But we do this quite often around here. But uh, there's a lot of stuff that can go wrong for a piece of logging equipment because you put it in the woods every day and then you get on the road and it ain't made to run wide open for as long as it does whenever you put it on the road. <clears throat> anyway, we get it. we get it done. I just wanted to tell everybody, hey, I'm still alive. Barely breathing, but I'm still alive. Um, I hope everybody has a good, good week, the rest of the week. I'm going to try and get y'all some more videos out. I'm going to try and get a video of the loader being crunk for the first, or being run for the first time with a new pump on it. It'll probably be today or tomorrow. I don't know if we get it out of the shop today. But hopefully we will. And if we do, I'll get a video of it. Um, so. I'll catch y'all later.